Good morning, good morning. Sorry, I just look like a complete mess. But today is an exciting day. The doorman from Lowe's is supposed to come and um, I think it's called Chiefs or something. They're supposed to come and install, finally install our front door. I hope he does a good job. They were going back and forth blaming each other and it was so difficult for me. Brian ordered this door in November. Today is May 12th. And so I hope it works out. He's supposed to be here at 8.30. It's 8.15 now. And then later we will uh, do a reaction to see Brian's reaction. Um, I won't say anything and see if he notices the door is there or not. And we'll see what he says, okay? So Kuma and Kitty can't come out. Let's see if they're here. Oh, yes. Morning. Kuma, he's just taking off the door, Kuma, don't worry. I know it's driving you crazy, all that noise, Kuma, but again, he's just taking the door off, so let's give him a break. Go play with all your ears and toys on the floor. Look at all the rubbish you made. Oh, they're taking off. Look how exciting. Look how exciting, Kuma. Look at that door. Wow. The door is coming off, Kuma. It's so exciting. My husband doesn't know, so it's gonna think he's seeing things. I know, I know, Kuma. Look at that. The door coming off. They have like maybe six guys to put in a door, so it's kind of interesting. And so it's like a really big project, I guess, yeah? Why are you barking at everybody? Hmm? You're making noise to everybody? Brian's gonna say he doesn't know guys he doesn't know that the door came and I got it installed today for him yes so he's happy he'll be I mean well I don't know if he'll be happy I know he will but I think it just makes such a big difference from that ugly door the glass makes the house look so much bigger but I'm gonna buy the um, film the window film uh, the decorated window film to um, so you can't see through in the glass on the side. 
It's not bad though. It's actually really nice. Now I wish I had a huge chandelier on the inside, but we bought that ruddy light instead. Yeah, I don't like that light, but Brian picked it. I think it looks too farm, like cottage feel or something. Yes, so let's see. Should be home soon. Come on. Come on, let's go play ball. Let's go back to play ball. Mm, good idea. Let Komayami take you for out for a walk. That looks like fried chicken, fried fish, spam, and teriyaki. And takuan, which is your pickled radish right here, your takuan. It looks really good. So fish, chicken, uh, teriyaki, and a spam. So let's give it a try. I mean, goodness, it's only $7.99. Hello, how are you all doing today? How are y'all doing um, with the uh, shutdown? Hmm? Uh, we have very, very few cases. And um, so I'm very happy. Of course, our restaurants, of course our restaurants are still not open. So um, we do a lot of takeout. And you know, it can get quite expensive. And um, I haven't been really big on too much takeouts other than like Sushi Man, uh, Panda again, not so much. Only that one time with the family meal because they don't have my favorite Beijing beef in Hawaii Kai. Um, some of the places are quite expensive. So um, I go to 7-Eleven quite a bit. You guys know that. I do like my spam musubi and stuff. Oh, by the way, how you guys like my gray? Coming out, yeah, the bento was only $7.90. It's a seven pack. Um, bento, okay. And I bought it because it was only $7.99 and I think it looks pretty good. So I'm going to give this a try, especially my fellow locals. I will tell you what I think, okay. I don't know if I can compare it to a zip pack because zip pack's quite um, pricey. Yeah, I don't know how much a zip pack is now. I don't go to Zippy's that much because I think Zippy's expensive, right? The only thing I eat there is the chili. The clubhouse sandwiches are way too expensive for me. So now Brian and I go to the Hawaii Kai Golf Course Clubhouse to eat the clubhouse sandwiches, right? Because it's cheaper. So let's see. I'm going to give this a try. Oh, so let's see what we should see here. Maybe we should try the fish. What do you think? Hmm, smells like a ketchup sauce or a tonkatsu sauce on that. Let's see how this one is. Mm. It's dark outside, so I have to videotape on my room. Mm -hmm. Okay, so here we go. I'm going to try, hmm, like a fish katsu. Mm. Try my garage door. I'm right next to my... Every time I start videotaping, my family makes all this noise around me. It's like all of a sudden they all gotta get up and do stuff. It happens all the time. And they're like, oh sorry. But they continue doing what they're doing. Like my mom, oh sorry. I'm wiping the floor today, you know, because we got Brian's new door. And the whole time she's like, I'm sorry, but she keeps walking past me after I wipe the floor. Sorry doesn't mean you can. Hmm. Right? Wow, this fish is really good. I'm super hungry. Wow, 7-Eleven, I'm impressed. Okay, spam has to be good, 7-Eleven. Right, is it just regular spam? Looks like it's regular spam. Mmm, this is nice. Good, I wish you fried it a little bit more. I like it when it's a little bit crispier on the end. Mm -hmm. But that's really generous. A lot of rice though, look how much rice. The whole bottom. So I'm gonna try this teriyaki. Let's try this teriyaki now. Try a piece of the teriyaki. Mmm. It is homemade. Mmm. Wow. Pretty good. For seven ninety nine. Rice is good. I like the fish katsu thing. 
I think if you had a bento with just that, I would eat that, or even a, oh, a fish katsu sandwich with that fish would be good. And then you put the sauce and some cabbage, and you make like the katsu sandwich in Japan. I think with this fish, it's excellent, yes. I like the fish. Okay, so let's try my fried chicken. Oh, it's a big fried chicken. Smells nice, the fried chicken. I love the fried chicken. It's not soggy at all. Looks like it's a thigh. Mmm, mmm. Mmm, I will say, I'm actually impressed with this chicken. The chicken, the spam, the spam is good. Not any kind of spam. But, gosh, you guys, for $7.99, I think that's a pretty good deal. Take it home, you can add more foodie kake, you know? Mmm. I like the fish. I like the fish the favorite. Wow. Wow, that's really good. I like that fish a lot. I'm actually impressed. $7.99, that's a pretty good deal. Cause I don't know how much the zip pack is now. It's gotta be at least $10. Those of you who do not live in Hawaii, um, these are like bentos that we eat here. Usually have a piece of spam, uh, some teriyaki. And so spam, I guess, lunch and meat, uh, a fried chicken and a piece of fish. And they serve them almost at like rainbows. They have them at Zippy's, most of all the plate lunch places. Very, very, very popular thing. Especially like when I was a kid, a teenager, bentos were so good to have for our field trips. You can just buy them and it was such a treat when my mom would give me money and I used, and back then we still only have Zippy's. So I used to buy a zip, well, no, there was more, but for me, Zippy's was the most convenient. So we'd buy that. We were so excited because they had so much food. Of course, by lunchtime, it didn't smell that good, but I just still remember. And I think um, Zippy's has other kind of like surf pack and stuff, but I will tell you, 7-Eleven is starting to get all kinds of great stuff. They have, they have, um, they have like synagogue, I saw like even, um, they have Vietnamese pho, they have um, sandwiches and pretty sandwiches. They have bentos. Um, I haven't seen ramen lately, which I was sad because I kind of really liked the tonkotsu ramen they had at one time, but you can't find them anymore. So I don't know if they just stopped having them in the Hawaii Kai um, 7-Eleven or, you know, again, because I heard that it depends where your location is, you know, what they have. But you can get a whole meal in our 7-Eleven now, but go early because there's competition now, but there's everything. And if you don't see any spam must be out, if you ask them, they usually have in the back in the refrigerator or in the freezer and they just have to zap in the microwave. But I will tell you, okay, this was a really, 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 really good bento, good bento. I like it for $7.99. So I gotta go give it um, a lot of my leftovers to my mom. My mom picks on all our leftovers, um, but I'm going to eat the rest of the fish because I like the fish. So I'm gonna keep the fish for me. Brian's calling me Elvira. Elvira, yeah. Furlough hair, furlough hair, yeah. There's a shirt I wanted to get you guys, this white t-shirt, the under unemployed white t-shirt says unemployed. It's so cute, but then, you know, again, I didn't want to spend any money because um, why? I'm going to be unemployed. I have no um, reason to be out spending money. There's, I have no, yeah, there should be no reason I should be spending money. I got a lot of things I got to save money for. You know? My mom, she's so happy. My mom's quite dependent, right? So, I think she's going to spend this check, but she got one. She's so happy. But she has nowhere to go now. She can't go to Japan to spend it. It's not like we can buy food, you know, all the Japanese food because Don Quixote, they, they don't have much stuff now because they're running low on stuff. And my poor brother who lives in Japan keeps sending my mom stuff, but this time we didn't get it yet. So we don't know if they confiscated a whole bunch of stuff because they're so strict now you can't have this, can't have meat or whatever. So some of the stuff, like even the instant ramen might have like a pork broth or meat broth. They might take that, the powder. So who knows? But we're kind of sad because it's just hard because there's no flights, I guess, coming. So my mom, you know, ordered like some mochi crunch and some seasoning and things for cooking. 
from Japan, but we can't get it. So Shinji, I was thinking too, right? Like I'm gonna pick up your mask this week and I was gonna send you the face mask, but I don't know if it's even gonna get to you too, if there's nobody going to Japan, right? Who knows? But yeah, you guys, this COVID-19 thing is frightening, right? Because we don't know if it's gonna get any better. So for me, I say, you know, save your money. I mean, I know it's important for the economy, but you know, save, you know, just cause we're getting some stimulus check like that. I mean, don't spend it all unless you're super rich. I'm not paying maintenance on that stupid apartment. But it's sitting there vacant for sale. Damn, that, hmm, hmm, it's fair. Fish is so good. No, this is it. <laughs> He's smiling. Yeah. Gotta paint it. Yeah, it's not too bad. come in. I finally did it after seven months. I didn't want to tell you that I had it off schedule. It's still not bad. Are you happy? Yep, finally. What do you think? I think it's gorgeous. I watched them the whole time. Okay. So I just got to buy something. I didn't realize you could see that much, so I kind of want the this privacy. Is, this is ugly. And we're, I told them to put the, the other guys were going to use this molding. Oh, well, the flat's in now. Okay. It's contemporary. I think that's why they did that. Well, once I paint it, I didn't realize you're gonna paint the whole thing. I was like, oh my God. So I bought blue tape today, razor to tape all the things. Yeah, I just worried about the privacy now. We already talked about that. We said we were gonna put the bubble yeah. stuff in the bedrooms on here and here. Yeah. Oh, it's so dark. Yeah, it's dusty. So you're happy? I'm happy, yes. How happy? One to 10? Ten. 10 being best. Yeah, I mean, not 10, but I'm happy that it took seven, seven months to get this done. I'm happy it's finally done. Okay, so, good. So, because you had, a, you had a centipede in here, right? You could see under the door before. Yeah, you see where the old flooring, though, it doesn't end. Watch out. Come on. At the right place. Yes, we gotta fix that. Yeah. It's all sealed off now, so that's good. Yeah. Nice. I don't know about sealed up. It's good. See that? Mm hmm Up here? Mm-hmm. It doesn't, like the old door rattled in the wind. This will yeah. do the same thing. Oh, well, what? Hmm? Even if I lock it? Oh. The door was just so awful before.